Hello everybody, and welcome back to Animal Crossing Wild World. I see a weed. But first, we gotta check our bail, which I don't think we actually have room to receive it. We don't. Um, oh, hold on. I don't, I don't trust those buttons. Uh, <laughs> so let's just toss these. Oh, wait. Okay, that confused my brain. Yes, toss. 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 Now we'll check. I don't know who or what it's from. Oh, it's from Peanut. You stay with this may seem kind of a sudden, but I moved. Peanut moved out. But why, Peanut? Why? Oh, well. Uh, <laughs> Hey, Buck. Evening, how's life, Governor? Whoa, it's already eight? Lame, I'm gonna be too, too old to collect furniture in no time. Time just flies. Enough of that, though. You got something to say to me, Governor? Any gossip? Say it's a good time of day to catch a flea. Uh, I have no idea. Well, if you find out when, let me know, Governor. Imagine any time would be a good time to catch a flea. You just need to find a villager who has fleas and hit them with your net. Alright, there we go. I think with Peanut having moved out, we have a good time to go over to where her house was. We and let's take our favorite flower from there and move it somewhere else as a way of remembering her. Sign. Um. Did I want? I don't remember if I did. Let's water that. You know what, let's, let's grab these. The uh, yellow roses. More, more, more flowers to water. Now, I'm going to check the stores first today before doing the daily routine. I guess it is kind of late, and the stores will be closing soon. I actually think Able Sisters might already be closed. Um, we're gonna buy those flowers. Let's take a look around here. What is this? That'd be the robo table. Hmm. It's kind of big. Uh, no thanks, no. Uh. I don't really want to look at the wallpaper and stuff, because, well, we... We already have some pretty good stuff, so... Red Cosmos, okay. I'll buy them. And I'll buy these too. Oh, white cosmos. Yeah, but why wouldn't I take those too, Nook? Um, be waiting. I don't doubt that, Nook. Now let's check in with the Able Sisters and hope they're still open. They are! Yay! She she's she's sewing a Mario pattern. <laughs> oh, welcome! I'm so glad I get to see your lovely face again, Stephen. Actually, this just between us. But when I see your eyes, I remember a strong memory from my childhood. Those perfectly round, sparkling glass marbles. That's right. It was back when my mother and father were still alive. They were both both working happily in the shop back then. Father bought. Uh, bought Mabel some marbles to play with. They were so pretty, so I asked, aren't there any for me, Daddy? Well, Father said, Sable, you're the eldest. You're too old for toys. When he said it like that, I just started bawling like crazy. It's not that I was at... Uh, it's not that I was at all that sad. Well, all that sad. 
but the tears kept coming anyway. They wouldn't stop. I just got so frustrated and snapped all of a sudden. Without thinking about it, I snatched away all of Mabel's marbles. And then everything just went to pieces. Mabel started crying, and Father got really angry. And I mean really angry. Then I ran out of the shop, in my bare feet no less. Oh, Jesus. I didn't know about that. I'm sorry. Oh, no. It's okay, Mabel. Even though we were always getting in trouble. Remember how Father would crack open the bedroom door at night? And how after we'd gotten into bed, Mother would come in and lay down with us. <coughs> with us. She'd hold her claws and say, uh, Let Sable's and Mabel's claws be kind. She said that in hopes that it would sustain us, you know, Mabel? Even though when work is... Uh, when work's at its worst, I'm, I'm fine because my claws are special. They hold Mother's love inside of them. Aw, oh, sis. Let's work together, huh, sis? They're so cute! Ooh. Ah, hockey mask. Nah. That was something other than a hockey mask. I don't like sporty things. Um... We just bought a new shirt yesterday. You know what? Let's, let's buy this. Let's, look at, let's, let's, get, let's get the scholar's hat. There. We, we have a hat. I'm probably not going to wear it. I might actually give it to a villager. They won't wear it either, but I might give it to one of them. I might give it to Buck. Um, or Hugh. No, Hugh. It's perfect for Hugh. Alright, okay, now let's get started on our daily routine. Because we, we need to get started on this. Kind of debating if I want to show it today or not. I don't know what else we're going to do, so I think I might show it. Um, not this rock. I think this might be the last day I show it for a while. I, I don't know. I'm, I'm still deciding things. I, I don't quite know exactly how I want to do this series. <laughs> it's not that rock. I'm, I'm kind of bummed that Peanut moved out. Because, I mean, she was one of our first villagers. Hey, Maple. Oh, hi, S-Star. Can you believe it's already 9 o'clock, honey? Wish you'd stop by a little earlier so we'd have more time to talk. I'm sure you had a lot of things to say today. I'm sorry for being being a crybaby. So, what can I do for you, honey? I'm bored. Say, Esther, do you know much about design? You know, feng shui? Uh, well, I, I do. I knew you had an eye, an eye for interior design the moment I saw you, Esther. The Happy Room Academy is just going to love you to pieces. Well, I'm sure they're going to try to do that because it means they get money probably because let's face it they're working with nook um not this rock at the very least though we do have the prospect of who our new next villager is gonna be hey octavan <laughs> off a little evening mischief steven who would have thought you'd be the you, you'd be one Ah, oh, God, I can't read today, and my throat's killing me. Uh, <laughs> who would have thought you'd be the one I'd need to keep an eye on, sucker? So anyway, did you want something from me, or what, sucker? Here to talk. Hey, Steven. I bet you think all I want to do is garden. Sure, I like to, garden and all. I mean, who doesn't? But first and foremost, I'm an octopus. And don't you forget it, either. I, I know, I, I won't... Octavan, please don't murder me. Um, I, I'm a digger first and foremost. I'm gonna dig holes. I'm half tempted to try and dig holes around him, but that's kind of mean, and apparently everyone else here is mean to him, so I don't want to be mean to him. Actually, as I mentioned before, I really like him, and I feel really lucky that we actually got an octopus. I don't know if we have a cricket or not. If that's even a cricket. 
I honestly don't remember, so I'm gonna catch it and try donating it. I missed. I don't know where it went. There it is. Eh. I will get it. House. Got it! Ah! A cricket. Autumn's own musician. Yeah, I think we've got one because I remember that. I remember that little tooltip saying. So I'm assuming we've already got one. But I'm still gonna try donating it donating it anyway, just in case. Whoops. Didn't mean to do that. Whoops. <laughs> I'm bad at this today. Now let's see here. Is it this rock? I might actually go around and um, gather some oranges and start growing a bit of an orange orchard. Because that would be a decent way of keeping our bells up. Oh, hi, Hugh. How you doing? It's really dark out now. Oh, I guess it's already 9 o'clock. That's okay, I can stay up all night long. So, yeah, we, we know, Hugh. So, uh, yeah, what do you want to talk to me about? Let's chit-chat. I wonder when this town is going to start being a more happening place. Ideally, I'd like Digby to be so crowded that it's like a fair all the time. Yeah, it would be kind of nice. I'm, I'm more partial to it being... A not so crowded place, but I'm fine with it being crowded too. I haven't seen a single like dig spot yet. Oh, there's another cricket. Maybe the cricket will bring us luck. Hopefully it will. I just dug under my own feet somehow. And uh, nope. Cricket did not bring us luck. Death to Cricket. Uh, do, do, do. The dig spot should really be easier to find as the year goes on. Because the snow should make them stand out a little more. Not this rock. Oh, is the money rock this one over here by the museum? Yes, it is. Oh, oh, this is bad. This is bad. This is bad. This is bad. This is... Okay, I still got the regular number. It was still kind of bad. Oh, I only have three inventory spots. Oh, God. Uh, I'm bad at this. Uh, let's, let's stack these up and, and put them in our wallet. I kind of wish the bells would go right to your wallet, but I understand why they don't. Let's plant the flowers that we uh, got from Nooks. That way we have the space to pick up these last four. And... hmm. Now what to do? Because we don't really have a new donation for the museum. Haven't really seen a spot yet, either. You could always just look around for one of those spots. Because there's got to be one around somewhere. I just don't know where it would be. Uh, no, that's just the ground. Hmm. These, I think this is dandelion puffs. Yeah, okay. We want to pick those up. Hmm. I don't know where the dig spots could be. I need to just start getting a ton more flowers around. 
Well, let, let's go check the lost and found real quick. See if Booker has anything for us. Hopefully he's got something new. He probably doesn't, though. Let's be honest, he's Booker. Uh, actually, what's new? Uh, no one. There's, there's no one visiting the town. I was kind of hoping someone might be here, but guess not. Something lost. Uh, we currently assume it's lost and found. Definitely have four. Uh, nothing new. Okay. No, it, it's okay, Booker. You're doing your job well. The only thing you don't do well is you don't stop me from taking literally everything out of the lost and found. Even though none of it is mine. Ma ma maple. Maple. Thank you. Uh, right. Town hall's over here. I can't remember anymore because Peanut's house... Oh, Buck wants something. Hey, yes, star. Listen, I know this comes out of the blue, but why don't you buy my Imperial Wall for 3,000 bells? Think of it as charity. Help me out, Governor. For you? Okay. Sweet, now you're talking, Governor. You got a killer deal, I guarantee it. Alright, Buck. I mean, I'm not the biggest fan of losing that many bells. But, yeah, we might we might get something else in here that's pretty valuable, too, so. And the Imperial Wall, if I remember right, is actually pretty cool, so. Cycling. What's here? Nothing. It's only Tuesday. There should be something. Usually they recycle something a day. I guess not. Um... Hmm. So it looks like we didn't even get anything from the recycling shop. Well, let's let's go plant those roses. Maple, please. I was trying to get around you. Um Yeah, you know let's plant them right here. And right there, they shall live. As a memory to Peanut. Now let's go have our coffee. Because it's probably good we come have our coffee. I mean, we, as I mentioned, we don't have anything to donate. Uh-oh, there's someone in here. Good day. Good day to you, too. Well, let's, let's talk to this. This is Phyllis. Hey, you. Just what are you gawking at, hmm? What? Nothing. Yeah, that's what I thought. Then go point those peepers someplace else. The nerve. That is Phyllis. She works the night shift at the uh, town hall. She's a lovely lady. Coffee may seem tight, but see one, please, Brewster. them before it gets cold. On fresh brewed cup. Enjoy. Thanks, I will. Mmm. Acid bitterness and boldness, all balanced in perfect harmony. Thanks. Let's talk to him one more time before we leave. Red's coffee you're after, you're in the right place. I know, Brewster. Well, um... I think that'll be it for today, and tomorrow we're gonna mix things up a bit. We're gonna go on a tree planting spree tomorrow. And hopefully I'll remember to actually send letters out today. So, we'll actually have mail. Because I've been forgetting to send letters, and that's probably partially why Peanut moved out. But let's actually quickly check out this wall. Imperial wall. Paste on wall. Ooh. Ooh, I like it. I like it. 
Oh, I really like this. I'm keeping that. That was well worth the 3,000. Okay, we have... That I'm gonna mail off, right. Uh, yeah, this is what I want. Uh, why was this down here again? Right, because I plan on using it at some point. These other ones are just, they're in storage until I find something I might want to use them for. So, and the hat I'm going to put away as well. Which was star, right. I, I just want to always be buying something from the Able Sisters. Oops, well, doesn't really matter. Well, with that and getting a new wall, I thank you all very much for watching and hope to see you again next time for more Animal Crossing Wild World. See you all then.